Whatever. Should be okay. Do I have to watch this whole cutscene over? Oh my god. Fuck, 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 fuck! Chill! Maybe we could walk? That's fucking stupid, baby. <laughs> I'm just saying. Hmm, I don't know. I ain't got much experience with y'all's fortitude, but we could probably deal with that. We got a goddamn train. I like this Day guy. It's not full of milk, Charles. That's gas or diesel. Something that's going to explode. You got to get a hold of yourself. This a crew here. Yeah. This a crew, boy. This ain't shit. This. Yo, you keep screaming like that and you're going to get your face chewed off. Are you guys going to be trouble? Because we could have just kept walking. <laughs> Define trouble. Anything that gets you killed, or worse, and it tends to come hand in hand with groups of guys in distress. Let's give these guys a break. We'll see. You guys got a problem with your train? Yeah, you're standing right in front of it. Dude, it's a wreck. It's not so bad from up here. Send your buddy up to have a look. I'm going, man. Chill. Sideways up there. We won't let them escape. Why not? Who cares if they just leave and don't talk to us again? What's the big whoop? Leads up to that wrecked tanker. Fuck him up there, please don't eat me. There. You better not be murderers or thieves. I guess you'll have to find out. A group of guys is what we need. They're what you think we need. We're doing fine. For now. What about when? Stop it. Hey, dude. I'm Omid. Lee. Krista. What's the deal with the train? We're driving it. Oh, man. What about when what? Look, you want to help us out? We could use some able bodies and... Yeah, we, we really need some help. What's in it? Oh, shit! God damn, you guys have a kid! Yeah, that's clown. What are you doing up here? What are you doing? Do you know how long it's been since I've seen a kid? Shit! What's your name? Clementine. Oh, so he gets to swear. <laughs> yeah, what the heck is up with that? Why can't I say shit? Her dad. He down there? It's that obvious? To me. And no, he's not down there. Huh. What's your story? I came across Clementine alone. First day all of this happened. We've been together ever since. And everybody down there, they're cool? I mean, we just freaking met Chuck, so, but he seems pretty chill. We just met Chuck, but he seems like an all right guy. Exactly. I always have to worry about new people. I used to love meeting new people. That must have been a long time ago. What, four months? What happened to you guys? A train is awesome, though. A tank is your real problem. We'll help you with it, but if we see anything we don't like, we're moving on down the road, alone. Okay. I appreciate the help. Can't just blast through it, I guess. If you could get it down, the rest would probably be pretty easy. We'll start there. We'll come down and settle in and see if we can help. How would the rest be pretty easy? I don't. I don't feel like the rest would be pretty easy. Take the tape. Hey. The only useful thing in here. But what about the stop signs? They're pretty drippy. Empty. That's what I figured. It's empty. Hmm. All right, let's talk to this freaking hooligan. There's no way I'm pulling anything apart down there. Hello. You're gonna have to tell your people the plan, or what? Damn, son. Shawty needs to chill. Guys, this is Omid and Krista. Not big on welcomes. Like I said, we could use some good people. We just wanted to say hi and say your train is pretty cool. But we're not looking for charity. We could help you guys, though. Maybe. 
We're gonna cut down the tanker. Tanker down and be on our way. Seems like plan enough to me. You want to start in on that tanker? I'll get to know the girl for a minute, if you don't mind. And why don't I show you how this thing works, in case something happens? Really, kid? It's probably for the best. Someone might want to have a look inside of that station back there too. Sounds great. Let's do this thing. Kenny, no. Kenny, don't die. Teaching him anything? Trying to. Kenny, no. Don't I don't you two made it this far. You seem dangerously normal. Krista doesn't let us join groups. And I'm a fucking scrapper. I got the feeling she takes care of you. Please. I've saved her ass hundreds. Yeah, I believe it. Sometimes. I believe. I believe it. How long since you've been home? Like six months. Six months? For a while and then... Oh, we. That's rough. Her cat is going to be pissed. <laughs> Learning the ropes can't be too hard, right? There are a lot of levers I can't wait to use. I said if something were to happen to me, maybe we can drive in shifts. We'll see. Talk to you later. Kenny, please. Kenny, don't die. I don't want to have to use the. Oh my god, they killed Kenny! Please. If I have to edit that, I'm gonna be sad. Hey guys, Clem. You interrogating this woman for us? Yep. She set off any alarm bells? Not yet. She's very thorough. That's what I like to hear. Hey there. That's a pretty useful radio for her to be holding on to, no? It's busted, but it means something to her. Oh, I understand. Where are you from? San Francisco. Jeez, a long way from home. I blame the one in there. He wanted the great American road trip. Well, he got a little more than he bargained for, huh? Who the hell is into Civil War history anyway, other than old white guys? Me, me. <laughs> That's so funny. What were you two arguing about when I was coming up the ladder? That's so funny. You just raised his hands. <laughs> if you're gonna be around for a while, be good to know what baggage you got. And maybe we won't be around for a while. Hey, that's, I mean, it's cool there. Not sure how we'll get that tank down. Maybe ask Omid. He likes to break things. What does that mean? What did Omid do to you? Careful, she's a crack shot now. You got this girl shooting guns? Look, I don't need a lecture. You weren't getting one. It's good. She should be able to take care of herself. Cool. Where's Ben, bro? I need to talk to Ben. I need to have some emotional. <gasps> He's freaking jamming out. I'm glad someone's managed to keep this spirit. Hell yeah, Chuck. Ben. Where is Ben? Ben, are you okay? Do I have to, oh my god, I have to, I have to get on the train. No, where'd Ben go? What? I mean, all right. See ya, I guess. Don't like the new girl? I do, but it's like we're a team, like you said. Yeah, all right. Come on. Clementine and I are checking out this train station, all right? Hustle over if you hear anything. All right, Clem. Let's do this big dog. 
Let's do this big dog. Survivors inside. Somebody must have been pretty desperate. Imports, auto parts. Clum, where'd you go? That paint has been dry for months. Clum? Oh, there you go. What do you think, Bob? What do you think, boss? What are we thinking? You should wait for me before trying to open doors. Sorry. Uh, luckily, it's locked. We'll get better at working together. <laughs> All right, body slam. Mm, won't burn. Doesn't look like that thing's worked in years. Hmm. Any ideas, Clown? We'll have to find a way in. Okay, by wheel it means me. Can I not walk any freaking faster, bro? Please. Windows open up there. Maybe I could look in. Good idea. Come here, boss. I put you on my shoulders and you can peek into that window up there. Sounds good. <clears throat> okay, I can see in. What do I do now? What do you see? Yeah, what do you see, Lots man? Of crates and stuff. Maybe we can find the key or figure out a way to knock this door down. Kenny'd probably have me pick the lock, which actually might work now that we have the time. I think I opened it. For real? I think so. No. Oh. From up there? Wow. Well, I'll be damned. Let's go, man. Let's go. Be careful. I will, I will. I'm supposed to tell you that. Damn, it's dark in here. Maybe I can hold the door open? I don't like that. I'll prop it open with something. Clam? It's too dark in there. Yeah. We should prop the door open with something. Did I not click the right button? Way too dark. Yeah, you're right. Hey, you feeling, boss? How we doing? Good. What do we need? Something to help us deal with the taker out there. It's locked up good, but there's some space at the top. We're lucky I'm so little. Yeah, we are. They didn't have much business back then. That's exactly what we need. Over there? Yeah, we need to get in there and get that blowtorch. All right, Clum. Locked up good. 
Come on. You okay going over the top of this fence? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Go on and grab the keys, Clem. Come on, scoot. Behind, Behind you. you. Oh no, Clem. Give me that. Nah, man. It's okay, it's okay. Everything's fine. Hey, at least she grabbed it. Clem, turn around. Keys, now! Give me the keys. Unlock the door. Still locked. Idiot! No, that was pretty good. It did not go so good. What do you mean? That wasn't bad. Everything's okay. We were kind of chilling. What's going on? I thought I heard a gunshot. We're fine. Zombie. We found some walkers. You and an eight-year-old versus three of them, huh? She kicked ass. We handled it. Yeah, it looks like. What if you hadn't? I'm gonna go make sure the noise didn't cause us any problems. That's a good idea. <laughs> what are you what are you freaking looking at? Doing with her? I do. Me too. For her sake. Bro, oh, I freaking got this covered. Christina needs to chill. You sure you're okay? Yeah, I'm a little shaky. It'll pass. We got it. Well, let's go outside now. What did we learn? I'm not ready for a gun. We learned not to be afraid. They should have got us, but we got them. Yeah, you're right. Exactly. The thing that will kill us. Exactly. Fear of the walking d d dead. All right, let's go, Clem. There's gotta be something useful in here. Let's freaking bounce. I found a blowtorch in the station. Should make quick work of the coupling up there. Excellent. I'll come up there with you to have a look. Clem, are you doing cool? You chilling? Big chilling? Hi, girls. Hey. We were trying to get used to being on our own. Clementine and I. So you take her into a dark, boarded up building to build character? Not exactly. I think it's a good idea, figuring stuff out for yourself, for what it's worth. But be smart about it though, you know? Teach her to scan the area for things. You two should never be looking in the same spot. That's a waste. Stay the hell out of places like that building over there. Especially if you don't have more than one way to get out. And be more afraid of groups of living men than dead folk. That we know. Omid and I are still alive because we're two, 
Not six, or eight, or ten. I don't believe in strength in numbers, and you shouldn't either. It's, I mean, I feel like that makes sense. Trust nobody except for your closest, you know? Day ones only. No one's less, no one else allowed to the party. There's like three people I would be willing to hang out with during a zombie apocalypse and... Oh. What is Ben doing? Holes as a leak in it. Turn it off, dude. I, I don't want my eyebrows burned off. Better plug that leak with something. Holy crap, it's like I have this tape. Hope this holds. That's crazy. Look at it go. Just about got it. Thanks. No sweat, man. This thing is hanging by a thread. The smallest cut and it'll go. Here. The weak portion of the coupling's out of my reach. You think it'll be within mine? <laughs> no. But I'm gonna dangle you over that ledge. The hell you are? God, you're a real son of a bitch, aren't you? Shut up and start cutting. Oh my god, we need to go. We need to leave, bro. Oh shit. Guys, there's something coming. What the what? There must be thousands. We gotta go. Fuck. Oh me. Cut, cut. I am. Don't let Omi die. Pull him up. Can he go? Everybody on. Shit. What the hell do we do now? Run. Never mind. How this works. Holy crap. Run, motherfucker! Come on, Omid! We gotta jump! What? No way! Omid, don't be a wuss. Jump, boy. Guys! Come on! Jump! No! Jump, damn it! Still no! Fine! Ugh. Oh my god. Oh, Omid. Oh, mead. Grab him. Grab her. No, her, not me. Krista, no! Fuck! You piece of shit! She's a woman! Don't you know? Uh. Baby, it's okay. What do you mean? She's a fuck. She's fine. Bye-bye, zombies. Idiots. That was a lot of them. Are you hurt? No, I'm chilling, bro. You're okay. Speak for yourself. My leg is spot. We're fine, Clementine. We're fine. Speak for yourself, my leg is bunched. Bro, you, you would have been freaking dead. You would have freaking died. What is that?
Oh, it's it's dark. Next stop, the Atlantic. Oh no. We're going our own way, Clementine and me. What the fuck does that mean? I just think it's it's time she and I parted ways with you. Omid and Krista can make their own call. Huh. I'm sorry. We made a plan. We talked it through. It's gotten too bad, you know. You, me, nobody can take all this. But we have. What we're supposed to do isn't clear anymore. I'd give anything to go back to fighting over the motel. Too. I'll leave you to your thoughts. She's out cold like I've never seen. <laughs> what the? Can't wait for you to get to Savannah, Clementine. I got your parents right here. And you be sure to find me, whether Lee wants you to or not. What the now, hell? What I need Shit. I thought that fucking thing was broken. So did I. Who the fuck was that? If he's convinced Clementine that he has her parents, y'all might want to rethink your plan. What the fuck? Who the hell? What kind of freaking better for which Minecraft YouTuber is talking to Clem? Don't tell me what happens next. Freaking hell, eh?